A dishwasher is a machine used to naturally clean dishware, cookware, and cutlery. Not at all like manual dishwashing, which depends intensely on actual scouring to eliminate ruining. The mechanical dishwasher cleans by splashing boiling water, regularly somewhere in the range of 45 and 75 degrees Celsius, 110 and 170 degrees Fahrenheit, at the dishes. With lower temperatures utilized for sensitive things, a blend of water and dishwasher cleanser is siphoned to at least one turning sprayers, cleaning the dishes with the cleaning combination. The combination is recycled to save water and energy. Frequently, there is a pre-wash, which might possibly incorporate cleanser, and the water is then depleted. This is trailed by the fundamental wash with new water and cleanser. When the wash is done, the water is depleted. More boiling water enters the tub through an electromechanical solenoid valve, and the flush cycles start. After the flush interaction gets done, the water is depleted once more, and the dishes are dried, utilizing one of a few drying strategies. Regularly, a wash help, a synthetic to lessen surface pressure of the water, is utilized to diminish water spots from hard water or different reasons. Notwithstanding homegrown units, modern dishwashers are accessible for use in business foundations like lodgings and eateries, where many dishes should be cleaned. Washing is led with temperatures of 65 to 71 degrees Celsius, 149 to 160 degrees Fahrenheit, and sterilization is accomplished by either the utilization of a supporter warmer that will give a 82 degrees Celsius. 180 degrees Fahrenheit, last flush temperature, or using a synthetic sanitizer. The main mechanical dishwashing gadget was enrolled for a patent in 1850 in the U.S. by Joel Houghton. This gadget was made of wood and was wrenched by hand while water splashed onto the dishes. This gadget was both sluggish and problematic. One more patent was conceded to L. A. Alexander in 1865 that was like the first yet highlighted a hand-turned rack framework. Neither one of the gadgets was common sense or generally acknowledged. A few students of history refer to as a hindrance to reception the verifiable mentality that esteemed people for the work put into housework as opposed to the outcomes, making family errands more straightforward was seen by some to diminish their worth. The best of the hand-fueled dishwashers was designed in 1886 by Josephine Cochran, along with specialist George Margerins in Cochran's device shed in Shelbyville, Illinois. When Cochran, a rich socialite, needed to safeguard her china while it was being washed, her creation was disclosed at the 1893 World's Fair in Chicago under the name of Lavadora. However, was changed to Lava Platos as one more machine concocted in 1858 currently held that name. Cochrane's motivation was her dissatisfaction at the harm to her great china that happened when her workers dealt with it during cleaning. Europe's most memorable homegrown dishwasher with an electric engine was developed and produced by Mealy in 1929. In the unified realm, William Howard Spices Up developed a little non-electric dishwasher reasonable for homegrown use in 1924. It was the main dishwasher that consolidated the greater part of the planned components that are highlighted in the models of today. It incorporated an entryway for stacking. A wire rack to hold the messy earthenware and a turning sprayer. Drying components were added to his plan in 1940. It was the principal machine reasonable for homegrown use, and it came while extremely durable pipes and running water in the house were turning out to be progressively normal. In spite of this, Perk Up's plan didn't turn into a business achievement. And dishwashers were just effectively sold as homegrown utilities in the post-bellum blast of the 1950s, though just to the well-off. At first, dishwashers were sold as independent or versatile gadgets. Yet, with the improvement of the one end to the other ledge and normalized level cupboards, dishwashers started to be showcased with normalized sizes and shapes, incorporated under the kitchen ledge as a measured unit with other kitchen machines. By the 1970s, dishwashers had become typical in homegrown homes in North America and Western Europe. 
By 2012, more than 75% of homes in the US and Germany had dishwashers. In the last part of the 1990s, makers started offering different new energy protection highlights in dishwashers. One element was utilization of soil sensors, which was a modernized device in the dishwasher which estimated food particles coming from dishes. Whenever the dishwasher had cleaned the dishes to the mark of not delivering more food particles, the dirt sensor would report the dishes as being spotless. The sensor worked with one more advancement of utilizing variable washing time. In the event that dishes were particularly grimy, the dishwasher would run for a more drawn out time frame than if the sensor identified them to be spotless. Along these lines, the dishwasher would save energy and water by just being in activity however long required. Dishwashers that are introduced into standard kitchen cupboards have a standard width and profundity of 60 cm, Europe, or 24 in, 61 cm, US. And most dishwashers should be introduced into an opening at least 86 cm, Europe, or 34 in, 86 cm, US, tall. Compact dishwashers exist in 45 in, 60 cm, Europe, or 18 in, 24 in, 46 and 61 centimeters US widths with casters and appended ledges There are additionally dishwashers accessible in sizes as per the European gastro standard norm Dishwashers might come in norm or tall tub plans Standard tub dishwashers have a help kick plate underneath the dishwasher entryway that considers less difficult support and establishment Yet tall tub dishwashers have roughly 20% greater limit and better sound hosing from having a constant front entryway. The worldwide norm for the limit of a dishwasher is communicated as standard spot settings. Business dishwashers are appraised as plates each hour. The rating depends on standard sized plates of a similar size. The equivalent can be said for business glass washers, as they depend on standard glasses, typically half quart glasses. Design present day machines include a drop down front board entryway, permitting admittance to the inside, which for the most part contains two or once in a while three take out racks. Racks can likewise be alluded to as crates. In more established US models from the 1950s, The whole tub carried out when the machine hook was opened, and stacking as well as eliminating launderable things was from the top, with the client venturing profound into the compartment for certain things. Youngstown Kitchens, which produced whole kitchen cupboards and sinks, offered a tub style dishwasher, which was coupled to an ordinary kitchen sink as one unit. Most present day machines consider position of dishes, flatware, Tall things and cooking tools in the lower rack, while china, cups, and saucers are set in the upper rack. One eminent special case were dishwashers delivered by the Maytag organization from the last part of the 60s until the mid 90s. These machines were intended for stacking crystal, cups, and saucers in the lower rack, while plates, flatware, and tall things were put into the upper rack. This one of a kind plan considered a bigger limit and greater adaptability in stacking of dishes and pots and skillet. Today, dish cabinet models wipe out the bother of the long arrive at that was essential with more seasoned full profundity models. Cutlery crates are likewise normal. A cabinet dishwasher, first presented by Fisher and Paykel in 1997, Is a variation of the dishwasher wherein the containers slide out with the entryway in a similar way as a cabinet file organizer, with every cabinet in a twofold cabinet model having the option to work freely of the other. Within a dishwasher in the North American market is either hardened steel or plastic. The vast majority of them are treated steel body and plastic made racks. Tempered steel tubs oppose hard water and safeguard intensity to rapidly dry dishes more. They likewise come at an exceptional cost. Dishwashers can be purchased for as costly as $1,500 plus, however, ledge dishwashers are likewise accessible for under $300. More seasoned models utilized heated lacquer tubs. 
while some utilized a vinyl covering clung to a steel tub, which gave insurance of the tub from acidic food varieties and gave some sound weakening. European made dishwashers include a treated steel inside as standard, even on low end models. The equivalent is valid for an implicit water conditioner. Washing components European dishwashers all around utilize a few sprayers which are taken care of from the base and back mass of the dishwasher, leaving the two racks unhampered, and furthermore, such models will generally utilize inline water warmers. Eliminating the requirement for uncovered components in the foundation of the machine that can soften plastic things close to them. Numerous North American dishwashers will generally involve uncovered components in the foundation of the dishwasher. A few North American machines, principally those planned by Broad Electric, utilize a wash tube, frequently called a wash tower, to coordinate water from the lower part of the dishwasher to the top dish rack. A few dishwashers, including many models from Whirlpool and KitchenAid, utilize a cylinder joined to the top rack that interfaces with a water source at the rear of the dishwasher and guides water to a subsequent wash shower underneath the upper rack. This permits full utilization of the base rack. Late model Frigidaire dishwashers shoot a fly of water from the highest point of the washer down into the upper wash sprayer. Once more, permitting full utilization of the base rack, however, expecting that a little channel on the top rack be kept clear.